my whole College Park family. The mayor of a big college town was arrested on several charges of possession and distribution of child pornography. When you're entrusted with such uh, a high, high office uh, elected uh, by the people, uh, that it, it is disturbing. It's disturbing uh, in so many ways. Uh, but I want to tell you guys about Food for the Poor. As we head into the weekend, I want you to re I want to remind you guys that every year at this time, I turn to you to, for generous gifts to help a Christian nonprofit, uh, Food for the Poor, and they have done so much work in our in the western in the Western Hemisphere, helping people in Honduras, helping people in the in the Caribbean. I mean, I want us to understand the focal point here because. I know for a fact everybody that's listening to this is like, oh, we got so much, so many things going on in the United States of America. Or, you know, why would you be promoting something that helps people outside of the country? And, and it's because these people outside of the country are doing way worse than the people that you see here in America. The poorest amongst us have free health care and food stamps, and they can actually get a job, but many of them don't even want to work. It's only the ones that have mental disabilities that are stuck on the streets and nobody can help them or the ones that actually are suffering the most. But in America, our poor... It's like wealthy people in other countries. Go to my website or text Tatum to 91999. That's Tatum to 91999. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, ladies, welcome back to the Officer Tatum Show. Let, let, I, I got to talk about this. I just saw an article that my producer sent me about the Maryland Democrat mayor charged with 56 counts of child... Uh, mentored... Allegedly, by Pete Buttigieg, I mean Buttigieg, and also he was a uh, LGBT activist. Fifty-six counts of child. My whole College Park family. The mayor of a big college town was arrested on several charges of possession and distribution of child pornography. When you're entrusted with such uh, a high, high office, uh, elected uh, by the people. Uh, that it, it is disturbing. It's disturbing uh, in so many ways. Patrick Woyan was the elected mayor of College Park, Maryland, and was in office since 2015. The city is home to the University of Maryland. Woyan resigned the night before his arrest. While this investigation does not involve any official city business of any kind, it is in the best interest of our community that I step aside and not serve as a distraction, Woyan said in a letter to the city. Investigators say the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children notified police that a social media account operating in the county possessed and distributed suspected child porn. They say through an investigation, they learned the social media account belonged to Wu Yan. Social media accounts, um, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, you name the, the various, uh, we, the list could be long and um, they are mandated to report whenever they find child exploited material on a device. Wu Yan was charged with 40 counts of possession of child exploitative material and 16 counts of distribution of the same child exploitative material. See, this is the stuff that I that I be talking about because I'm just doing an in, in, entire three hours of the show. We're, I'm talking about these things. I'm talking about how the LGBTQ agenda is pushing this, this sexuality on kids. They're, they're pushing pedophilia on kids. And, and, the, and a lot of these people that's associated, they're doing, they're messing with child porn. How do you get child porn on your, and and, I, and my wife just told me, I was on the phone with her, she said it was on this government computer. How do you get child porn on your government computer, bro? First of all, from my understanding, it's not on the internet. Like, you can't just find it on the internet. I'm, I'm a hoping it's protected off the internet. They can easily ban any presentation of child pornography so then you must have to go through some crazy you you got to go meet somebody in a dark alley somewhere to get something on a flash drive or go to the dark web which i don't even know how to even get to a dark web so but you have to be doing extra stuff to get to this stuff i'm going to read the article here because i don't want to miss anything maryland democrat mayor um, has been arrested and charged with possession of a uh, distribution of child pornography or child sex abuse material uh, College Park Mayor Patrick Wohan, I don't even know how to say his name, maybe it's Wo Wohan, um, whose city is just a few miles east of Washington, D.C., was arrested Thursday by the Prince George County Police.
police department. And the funny thing is the, the chief of Prince George is Malik Aziz, which I actually know Malik Aziz. Um, back, way back in the day, he was the president of the black uh, police, the black police officers association. And he was actually in the running to be the chief of the Tucson police department. When I was there, he was far more a better candidate than that clown that they picked. And they only picked him cause he was gay. And, and then he ended up working for the border patrol. And I think he's sitting at home. I don't know. Counting sheep. It says the 47 year old resigned Wednesday evening ahead of the arrest. And after authorities searched his home Tuesday and confiscated multiple digital devices, this idiot was the mayor um, since 2015 and served on the city council since 2007. The University of Maryland flagged uh, flagship campus in College Park. Uh, Wuhan has a law degree from Georgetown University and is a graduate of Harvard uh, Kennedy School. He is also an LGBT activist. Now, if you look at any of the news outlets, they don't want to talk about the fact that he's an LGBTQ activist. They don't want to talk about his association with all of this stuff. This is, in my opinion, this is sexual perversion. Let me continue with the article. It says the National Center uh, for Missing and Exploited Children notified police February the 17th of a suspicious social media account operating in the com- in the county, according to uh, NBCWashington.com. This is what it says, quote, the image and videos which the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children believed to be child sex abuse material had been uploaded to the social media account in January of 2023. Bro, he's starting a year off wrong, according to a release um, to a release by county police throughout various investigation te- investigate investigative techniques. Uh, PGPD investigators discovered the social media account belonging to Wuhan. Police took Wuhan into custody Thursday morning and charged him with with 40 counts of possession of child exploit exploit exploitative uh, exploitative material and 16 counts of distributing of child uh, material. That's what the NBC uh, report says. It, I find it very interesting that one, this person is a Democrat. Two, this per- I mean, it's not interest. I'm not shocked. But two, this person is a Democrat. Well, one, this person is a Democrat. Two, this person is the LGBTQ activist. There's another article. I think this was on TikTok. So this gives a little more context. Authorities um, have accused him of uploading and sharing dozens of videos to a social media app all called Keek, Kick in early January and um, depicted explicit sexual acts involving prepubescent boys and adult men. The National Center of Missing and Exploited Children flagged uh, the suspicious, I don't know, it's his kick account, and they showed the police, and this is what uh, he they ended up finding. It says he waived his Miranda rights and told investigators that the kick account was his. Police said um, that he advised that he was, he has viewed and possessed files depicting child pornography. He admitted to it. And here's a, another statement. It says, I have cooperated fully. And this is, I guess, his statement. And I will continue, continue to cooperate with law enforcement, Wuhan wrote in his resignation letter, which the city shared publicly. While this investigation uh, does not involve any official city business of any kind, it is in the best interest of our community that I step aside and, I guess, take a back seat while I go to prison for messing with, for dealing in child pornography. 40 counts, like I said before, and then 16 of the other particular charges. I hope Malik Aziz do a great job here and arrest this guy. I mean, not only arrest him, but I hope that they prosecute him for what he did. Uh, another article, I see, I, I'm reading my articles backwards. The important ones are at the bottom right now. LGBTQ activist, uh, Democrat mayor, who was mentored by Buttigieg, I mean Buttigieg, arrested for child pornography. Um, and, and, you know, if you ask me, I think Buttigieg needs to be investigated as well. If you don't have child pornography, that's totally fine. But you still need to be investigated because you and you mentor the person who's definitely dealing with child pornography. And and maybe I'm out of the loop, but I feel like people that do ch- that mess with child pornography, it's they they in a web of some other crazy stuff. They, they didn't win. They in some other stuff. 
But I don't want to say that. In, I mean, I don't care if somebody investigate me. If, if if I'm mentoring a guy and he messing with child pornography, of course, I wouldn't know. And if I didn't know and they want to investigate me, I'm like, come on, here, man. You can check out my device. Do whatever you got to do, man, because I hope that fool go to prison. He making me look bad. Anyway, I just wanted to throw this out here so we people are aware. This is the type of stuff that I'm talking about. These people are sexually deviant. It's not just you live and let live. These people are, are, are really deviant. And, and I would argue that a lot of these people fall into the LGBTQ sphere because it's a sexual deviant. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, I put out three videos a day. So make sure you go to the uh, playlist that says new video and watch more videos. Subscribe to this channel. Let's go, baby.